I'm Jackson Pierce, and this video blog is about a problem I have. So since I write full time, I'm home during the day, and that means that if I ever turn on the TV, like during a lunch break or that kind of thing, I inevitably am going to be watching daytime TV. Daytime TV is very different than normal TV. There are pretty much only three things on TV. There's either daytime talk shows, CSI reruns, or infomercials. I don't really like talk shows too much, and if I watch CSI, I do that thing where I sit down to watch one episode, and then I just end up watching CSI for like hours, and so years ago I had to just cut CSI out of my life. Infomercials, however, are really hard to avoid, because if you find like even one normal TV show on during the day, inevitably there's going to be an infomercial during the commercial break. Infomercial during the commercial. That's tough. And when I watch infomercials, this happens. We've all been there. It's Saturday morning. Whoa! It could right through the grime on that boat. I mean, I don't have a boat, but what if I get one and I have nothing to clean it with? I bet I could use it to clean other stuff too, like the, um, the ceiling. Yeah, the ceiling and my potential boat. I've got a call right now. So you're saying I can use it on like my oven? What about like the dishwasher? Yeah, it's a great commercial. You should get that Billy Mays guy though. He's really good. Oh, that's right, hang on. And it said that if I mentioned I saw it on TV, that you would include a free laser pointer. So yeah, I don't know why that happens. I feel like my brain is just more susceptible to infomercials and like the line. So I've decided no more daytime TV for me. Just none. Can't do it. I'm, I'm really sorry, CSI, that I was secretly watching, even though I said I wasn't watching it anymore. Oh, what do I care? It's not like it's been good ever since Morpheus joined the cast anyway. All right, time to answer comments as promised. Uh, Weasley is my king. One, I absolutely love your username. That's fantastic. Two, anytime a literary figure is referred to as yummy is a good time in my book. Uh, Celine, yeah, I have no idea why that's necessary. I completely agree with you. We do not need to know how much Hester loves sewing. Winky Blinky, I can't decide if I feel really sorry for your cat or if I'm delighted, but either way, that is fantastic. Uh, Chelsea, yeah, when I read Dante's Inferno, I looked at all my friends and tried to decide which circle of hell we'd all be going to. And Kelsey, I agree, Swiss Family Robinson, not a great book, but you know that you watched the movie and dreamed of having that treehouse. You know you did. I did. Who's that out on the road with arms outstretched and he's walking really slow? I stop to check to see if he's alright, but he moans for brains and mind those hunger in his You're saying that I can major in either business management or accounting? Well god, how does anybody choose? I mean, hang on, you know, I'm gonna ask my dog. Say so stuff, pick your head up if I should do business management. She said no. Okay. Pick your head up if I should do accounting. She's no help. I have no idea what to do. How do people make these decisions? 